Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to play GOG games on your Steam Deck and add everything to the game mode so you can play it on the go. And if this is your first time looking at the desktop mode, you need to go to Power and then go to Switch to Desktop, and it'll bring you to this screen. Then, once you get here, go down to the bottom left and go to Discover, this little folder, and open it up. And this is going to be the Steam OS or Linux kind of app store right here. Then in the top left, we want to get heroic. So just type in heroic like this, and this game launcher will open up. Otherwise, you can type in Lutris as well. So these are just game launchers with uh, various different stores like Epic Game Store. I think Lutris has Ubisoft in it too. So if we just go to this, then we can install it right here, and then go to launch. So let me just open this up. Both those will have the GOG game store as well. It's just a matter of, you know, which application you want to go ahead and launch. So you can see GOG right here. No games found. And then we can go to games right here. So I have uh, just these on the top. So you can go through here and you should be able to open those up. Uh, if we go on down, we can see the different options. But if I go on over to the uh, heroic one, that one's a little bit user friendly. A little bit better so we can go to that and you can go directly to the store where you can see it so i'll open up this one because it's a little bit easier to see too so just install it go to it launch it and this is what this one looks like now this one looks like the actual epic store so you can see my library but we want to go to store right here and then we got the epic store on the top and then we got gog and then if you do any kind of prime gaming so it says I'm not logged into GOG, which is true. I don't have an account for it right now uh, where I'm logged in. And then you'll be brought to the store. Now, I like going to the Epic Game Store because they have free games each month. And I just check those out and I add them to my library. But I think they do the same thing on GOG as well. Just sign in with your account. Scroll on down and you should be able to find any kind of discounts or uh, free games for the month. So you can see and once you add the game to your account, it's going to be under the library under here. So just install it on your device and go to library. And then you can find the game under here. Then you want to go to the game, like Rocket League, and then you can go to the three little dots and go to add to Steam. Now you want to open up the launcher every so often to update the game. Otherwise, it's not going to auto update when you're in the game mode. So you can open up the launcher in Game Mode 2 and you can add the game to uh, Steam, Game Mode, if you just open up Steam. So let me get rid of this. It's in the way. I can't remember how I do this. So let me just get rid of this. And then you can see Steam on the desktop. So it's located right here. So open up Steam. Go to Add Non or Add Game down in the bottom left. Go to Add Non Steam Game. Just like you would on your PC. And then go to Heroic Game Launcher or Lutris. And select it. Oh, we can even go to Discover. Let's go to Discover and add that to our game mode. So when you go to Add Non-Steam Game now, uh, you can launch those applications through the game mode. So you just have to go to Library, Tab Over, use an R1, and go to uh, Non-Steam Games. And then you can launch it in there. So I just added Discover to it. Well, I added Google Chrome here too. But you can launch those game browsers now, even to Discord. And then you should be good to go. So just sign in with your GOG account. And then open this up, up every once in a while. You'll have to go to, um, I think you'll have to select like play on it. Uh, when you go to like the game launcher. And that should prompt an update. So it's not just going to auto update. So like for Rock League, for example. So this is probably important to know. Otherwise, your game won't ever be updated. So let's go to Heroic here. You know, otherwise, I can just scroll on down to, oh, this is settings. I can't really see. So let's open this up. Here's installed. And here this is. So let's launch it. So you need to go to the game. And then where it says play now, just hit play now. And that will force an update. So it says installed. That means there's no update. If it says some long thing right here, 
that means there's an update. So you got to do that before you play, otherwise you won't be able to play online. But hopefully this video did indeed help you out. Did leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe my channel down below for more tech help videos coming up next on your six studios.